Hi, today we're in Los Padres National Forest. It's the middle of July. We're looking at this guy here. This is a Coulter Pine. He's Pinus Coulteri. They grow about 80 feet tall. This guy, he's about 60 feet tall. Wow. It's huge. Real narrow, all the way to the top. This guy here we're gonna take a closer look at because I can get to him easier. He's probably, I don't know, 30, 40 feet tall. Wow. So our coulter pines are native to Southern California all the way down to Baja, California. And they always prefer the south facing slopes. So here's west, sun is setting, and this whole slope here faces a little south west so they like this area as opposed to the other side and this guy he's got these huge pine cones it's called a widow maker because if you stand under this tree the pine cones fall on your head your wife becomes a widow so here's our uh, little pine cone so the pine cones themselves right they can get uh, like up to 16 inches long even weigh up to 11 pounds. That's like a bowling ball. This guy's like six inches. Here, this guy weighs about four pounds. He's probably 10 inches. We've got another one here, a little older, opened up. All right, he's about, I don't know, 12 inches. I think he weighs about, I don't know, maybe seven or eight pounds. So falling on your head, that would be a problem. Let me tell you a couple facts about our little Coulter Pine here. So he's a coniferous evergreen tree. I said he grows like 35 feet to 80 feet tall. His uh, trunk here, that can get about three and a half feet in diameter. It's very vertical at the start. Then he branches out very evenly to balance himself out. And his branches, they always curve upwards. See how they curve upward like that? This guy's drooping a little bit. Typically, they always curve upward. So that's a good sign it's a culture pine. And the needles here, take a look at the needles. Okay, they come in batches of three. So I hope we get a batch of three. Pull one off here. Let's see. Pull this guy off. Look at that. One two, three. So either that was very lucky or this is actually a culture pine, which it is, by the way. Okay, and his uh, cones as well. So these are edible, by the way. And these be eaten by our Native Americans. I've never eaten one, so I'm not sure what it tastes like. And the wood, up close, is really soft, weak wood. You almost press it. The bark peels off really easily. But he's not very good for woodworking because he's so soft. He's only good for burning, like in a fireplace. And the woodpeckers, they love this tree because the woodpeckers eat the insects and the bark is so easy to peel off. They just pick away and they peel off the bark and they get the little bugs underneath, like a Nuttles woodpecker or an acorn woodpecker, maybe even a downy woodpecker if you find them up here. So there you go. These are beautiful, beautiful Coulter pine. I said this guy is only about, I don't know, 35, 40 feet. This guy, a little larger, but imagine 80 foot high pine cone dropping on your head, weighing like 11 pounds. It's like a bowling ball dropping from way up there all the way down your head. Wow, okay, so hope you like that video. Have a great day, bye.